one thing I really want to talk to you about is the App State game, right? For sure, yeah. Because that game was, it was just unbelievable. <laughs> it, was, it was like, I'm sure you've heard this a lot, but it reminded everyone of like the old, you know, not old Clemson, but 2020. It's <laughs> yeah, been a long yeah, time yeah, since yeah. it's been like a blowout like that. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. you know, you can see the morale on campus is just different. But mm-hmm. in the locker room, the guys, like, how do you guys feel about that win? Like, was that just, was that fun to be in? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Uh, everybody just making plays. Um, you know, we we got it all figured out. I believe um, everybody everybody uh, we just believed in each other. You know, we didn't get shooken up by the first game or anything. Everybody just kind of just stayed and put their head down and got to work the next week. Nobody really nobody's gonna quit on us, especially everybody in our circle. Uh, we don't pay attention to out, outside noise like that. So we kind of just you know and you know. And we take we take a win as like we take a blowout the same as we take a three point win so mm-hmm. we all just celebrate the same, uh, but it's a good thing that we got a, a you know blowout for yeah. Uh, yeah. Since, for a while it's been a while since we got a blowout like that so it was pretty fun yeah you know it was and you could I mean the fans they were loving it too like you could tell during the game it was just that first touchdown pass I mean the roar of the stadium was crazy yeah it was yeah. pretty crazy like third play or something like third yeah. play in the game yeah it was pretty sick yeah. uh see brian get out there like that um but yeah it, it was really, so I, I expected that out of mm-hmm. somebody like him so yeah so i want to ask you about the the true freshman receivers right tj moore brian wesco you know what, what are they like what are they like on the field on practice right because it's not unusual but i mean they contributed right away you know for was, sure yeah uh, yeah, those guys from the time that they got here, uh, Brian, I think Brian had like one of the fastest times. Uh, he had like a time faster than Nate Wiggins in the flying 10. Was, That's crazy. Uh, yeah. Which the, is, the Nate Wiggins? The Nate Wiggins. That's yeah. crazy. Wiggins is a speedster. Yeah. yeah. Nate, Nate's probably one of the fastest guys that could yeah. come through Clemson. But yeah, um, you know, it was just, it was just really impressive watching both of those guys, mm-hmm. uh, you know, as they just continued to learn the offense. Um, they just got better and better. You know, me being on the offensive side, I saw it too. So it was great to watch. Yeah. Yeah. And, and this is a little, I don't know if it's off topic, but the the bounce back from the Georgia game to the App State, I don't think you, like Clemson played bad against Georgia, right? I just mm-hmm. think it was week one, and the biggest jump a team can make in football is week one to week two. Right. But what did you, like, were you able to learn a lot from that game as a team and implement that in, during the App State game and going forward? Yeah, um, I think that Coach Sweeney really gave us the confidence saying that, like, hey, like, we didn't do bad. We just had some minor mistakes, you mm-hmm. know. But, you know, uh, he encouraged us to, you know, continue not get shaken up. Don't listen to outside noise. Like I said earlier, um, we, we don't – like, a loss like that didn't – take us back we kind of just stepped forward if that makes sense mm-hmm. it kind of just made us better honestly what was it like having your dad you know be the honorary captain it was it cool just like being a part of a game opening yeah. night and like he's you know the whole fan base gets to see him and, and yeah everything. uh i didn't see them like announcing him as the honorary captain but uh i know that they my dad had told me like a week prior that he was going to be our honorary yeah. captain which is pretty cool and um you know seeing him on the side of the hill like i got to give him yeah. a high five and my mom high five going down yeah. the hill and stuff. Yeah. That was pretty cool. And you know, to just have my dad recognized is a like honestly an honor. Uh, just shows the hard work that he put uh, being at Clemson. So yeah. Throughout that game, like I said, like the first touch on pass, the crowd erupted. But could you feel the energy the whole game? Just like oh yeah, how electric that was. Yeah, it was great. Um, through and through throughout the whole game, especially, you know, everybody loves the fourth quarter, you know, beginning of fourth quarter, that mm-hmm. video is hype. All the lights going during a night game. Uh, it's nothing like it, which is, that's why that's like one of the best parts about a Clemson football game. Everybody's cheering to the end of the game, mm-hmm. you know, and uh, man, it was home opener to be able to blow a team out like that. That was, that was yeah. pretty cool. When you were playing the App State game, I mean, what was it like stepping on the field again for the night game, playing, being there? You were on the field, you know? Yeah, I mean, I was I was ready to go. Um, you know, I've been waiting a couple years uh, to just, you know, get on the field like that. Um, you know, I, I felt like I prepared well. Um, I wasn't really – I wasn't scared because I've been in that situation before mm-hmm. a couple of times, so I was kind of just like, yeah – like, it's just another game for me. Just you kind of block out the noise. You don't really 
listen to everybody. Mm-hmm. Um, like, uh, yeah, it's just football. It's just another day of football for me, yeah. honestly. Yeah.